we are on location here in Nashville, Tennessee at CMA Fest 2017. It's where thousands of country music fans come from all around the world to see their favorite country artists perform and get a chance to meet them. There are hundreds of free performances and artist events all throughout the city of Nashville. It's a four-day festival where thousands of our friends come to enjoy country music, the outdoors, and just having a good time. We are here with Craig Campbell. This is your event. This is our second time with you. Tell us about this event and about Fight CRC that you're such a big advocate for. Well, this is our fifth annual Craig Campbell Celebrity Cornhole Challenge. You know, I teamed up with Fight CRC a couple of years ago. Uh, I've always wanted to work with a, an organization that was strictly colon cancer based. And uh, these guys had a great profile and I wanted to be a part of it. So uh, we teamed up. And you know, the last three or four years, we've been we've been working hard together, trying to raise awareness and raise money to uh, to eliminate colon cancer. So that's that's our mission. Craig Campbell's Celebrity Cornhole Challenge. Are you a big cornhole player, or are you new at this? Uh, we've been playing cornhole for a long time. You think you're gonna win this cornhole challenge? I'm gonna do it this know. year. <laughs> Is this your first cornhole challenge? Oh, ever? Yeah. Ever? <laughs> yes. Yeah. I've been every year that Craig's done it. And You're winning an award, that's right. Am I? Uh, hopefully first place, if he doesn't cheat again. <laughs> well, we've yeah. done this a couple times before. Uh, I, I believe it's the first time for Matt, but uh, all three of us have done it before. My big thing is I want all these other people to see. We're a unit. You're a unit. Yes. If you're just catching up with this, this is Michael Ray's teammate. What's your name? Jamie. Sure not your first game of cornhole that you've ever played. Oh, no, no, but it is my first cornhole challenge, yeah. You. Have you been practicing? Yeah, absolutely. If you live in Nashville, you're, you're always playing cornhole. I'm no good at it, but we'll, <laughs> we'll figure it out. Well, it is CMA Fest. Do you guys have a good CMA Fest memory? I know this isn't your first rodeo when it comes to CMA Fest. No. Uh, my, my favorite is we actually, when Kiss Me or Not um, was a hit, we... Uh, <laughs> We played over at the stadium and we played acoustically, which was amazing to be in a huge stadium and just play acoustically. Yeah, there's so many. Uh, Lee Bryce and I used to combine our um, our fan club parties. Very cool. And one day we said, let's just stay here till the last person leaves. And we stayed there for 15 hours. So we had our, our big, all our faces on this huge billboard downtown. And it was like right after we got signed. And uh, that was one of the coolest things that we've ever seen. Yeah. Do you have a good CMA Fest memory? I know this is not your first rodeo. You've gone a couple of these, haven't you? Yeah, this is our third year being able, our fourth year participating, being able to play some shows. And um, I think one of my favorites uh, is playing Riverfront. We played it last year, and we get to play it again this year. Have Floor George Line or any of those guys? They tried to take you hunting or shooting yet? Uh, several times, and I've been out with Jason a lot. Me and Chuck Wicks, and when Jason. Chuck and I went out and we got the worst chiggers I've ever had in my life because of Chuck Wicks. I'm excited about this year. It's already been so much fun. Getting to participate in this cornhole tournament with Craig is, uh, is going to be amazing. It's my first year, so I'm, I'm excited. Hey, how are you, Billy Ray? Good. So you performed on the big CMA Fest stage the other night. How was that? Oh, uh, big fun. Uh, it's great. I uh, got a killer band. We're looking forward to this summer's tour, and uh, the fans were great. We got the Swan Brothers. Y'all are NRA Country Featured Artist alumni. I yeah, like it. That's right. That's right. We are. We have the hats to prove it. We got the opportunity to hear you sing God Bless the USA before Trump at NRA annual meeting. That was amazing. I just wonder if that ever gets old to you, if it's always just such an honor. No, it's an honor, and particularly when somebody gives you a microphone and say, here, introduce the leader of the, wor of the free world and don't foul this up. Uh, <laughs> so it's, it's, a, it's a great privilege, and, and that's the fourth president I've done that for. I was told to ask about your shirts. What's going on with these things? Uh, we had a little mix-up. If you can see, I'm actually Colton, and they gave me, they gave me Zach's jersey. I'm Zach, and I'm really scared of what's going to be printed about my name after he, the way he performs today. Allie, are you a big outdoors girl? Do you like doing anything in the outdoors, like fishing or kayaking? Yeah, I fish. Actually, there's a pond in my backyard that I fish at a lot. I also love hiking, kayaking, and paddleboarding. Um, but I can't say that I, I've ever played softball. So I think that that will make for an interesting day here. Yeah. <laughs> so are y'all big sports, like a sports family? Or do you get guys play baseball together? Big sports that are inside where it's climate controlled. So basically basketball, so he can look pretty. 
I look pretty on any field. Hey, I'm Craig Morgan. You're on location with NRA Country.